Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a super exciting video. I've honestly never done a video like this, so I'm like super nervous and like super excited to do it, but I'm not quite sure how I'm going to name this video, but pretty much my husband bought me a purse, a designer purse for our anniversary. We have been together for now seven years on February 15th. It was seven years of being together and four years of being married so he surprised me with a designer purse and I am so so excited but I quickly did want to make a disclaimer that in no way shape or form am I bragging or trying to be annoying by like shoving this designer purse in your guys' face um I just wanted to show you guys. I am obsessed with unboxings so he did give it to me a little bit early so I could unbox it and share like it all with you guys like how it comes and just you know the whole experience I personally love watching these types of videos so he wanted to give it to me a little bit early so that I could really have that experience and share it with you guys and I mean if you guys want a designer purse you kind of see how it comes um, especially if you get it in the mail so a little backstory to this is I've been looking at bags I normally am NOT a designer person I don't really care for a name brand I can buy a bag at Walmart I can buy one at Target and I'm good to go. I have two kids. We always put our kids before us. I mean they are the most important thing in our life having them making sure they're well taken care of and I mean bills and you know we have vehicles and like saving for a home so like all that is before designer items we've always been like that but this is just such a sweet and amazing gesture and I'm like honestly over the moon ecstatic over this but the last couple months I've been looking at designer purses and I mean Louis Vuitton we all know that price tag like that is very expensive but he knows how much I love those purses but I also love other designers and I just see and read and hear like how good these purses hold up from Michael Kors to Rebecca Minkoff to Louis Vuitton Chanel like these purses you invest in them and they last and they wear beautifully and they're just a different material and personally for me I go through purses like that like they just don't last for me and like my lifestyle and so I had been talking to him about like you know maybe getting one like we'll save like it's not something that's like super important to have like right away and he surprised me with the bag that I had been wanting and I just think it's amazing and I wanted to share it with you guys so to begin with I did get a Michael Kors bag but can you guys guess like which bag I ended up getting. I know there's like a huge range, but I personally got something that will work for me, my lifestyle, and I just thought it was like the sweetest thing ever that he pays attention and saved it and bought it for me. Like I just, it's perfect. Like I haven't even unboxed it and I'm already saying it's perfect, but let's get into the unboxing. So this is how it came. I'm covering the address, but as you guys can see, it is kind of a large box. I'm so so excited okay so it does come well protected in like this bubble wrapping let me go ahead and show you guys that is what it looks like it is a black bag I will say that I feel like for me black is well of course it's like a neutral but like I personally gravitate towards like black or gray purses and I'm so happy he chose the black one because it was the one I was really wanting so this is how it comes in this little bag oh what was that so these two little things fell out of this this is to kind of keep the structure of the bag good and like while it's shipping out I honestly think I might keep these for when I store the bag like if I'm going to the baseball park I probably won't be taking this bag so I'll probably save these for when it's being stored in my closet um, and I'm not using it so it stays well structured I'm so excited so now let's go ahead and take the little bag off and it does come with tissue Ooh, it looks so so pretty so I got the Michael Kors Selby medium bag I always want to call it the Shelby but it's Selby it's without an H but ah, it looks beautiful so let me quickly go ahead and take these little protectors off 
right here. I do appreciate how well like wrapped this bag is. The thought that it was in the mail like freaked me out but he said it came like relatively quick too so I think that's also like a huge plus. So like I said I'm just going to quickly take off the protectors. Alright, so this is what the bag looks like now that the protectors are off of the handles. It does come with this little charm right here, which is really cute. It has the Michael Kors emblem, and right here it says Michael Kors on it. It is absolutely stunning. Like, I saw it online a million times, and just seeing it in person is just like, wow, like this bag is stunning. I cannot believe it is mine. And also right here, it did have protectors on here, the little gold clasps right here, where you hook on the strap. So I really do appreciate that. All the gold hardware has protectors, which is amazing. I honestly am so happy with how diligent they were with everything like covering everything and like the packaging it's like impeccable honestly oh it just looks so so pretty like oh. so now let's go ahead and open her up and the reason i love the selby bag is because it comes with a zipper for me that was a huge thing i am very careful and always need a bag with the zipper i just feel like I don't know like I need my stuff to be extra protected especially if like sometimes I have my purse in like the shopping cart and you never know like someone can just dig in there and rip out your wallet but with the zipper I feel like it kind of helps that's just me so I honestly needed like there were so many beautiful bags but there were some that just didn't come with the zipper and that for me was a huge turnoff so this is what it looks like on the inside and in here it comes with a dust bag which is major because when I store it it'll be stored in its dust bag and I believe that's upside down so this is what the dust bag looks like it's really beautiful soft material and also on the inside of the bag we have the straps because this bag is a crossbody and it is stuck to something. So let me go ahead and take out all this tissue paper. They stuffed this bag so well. It's like crazy how much is in here. Like it's like, wow. And there's still more, which like I said is nice though because it really helps keep the structure of the bag. And then it has this like cardboard paneling right here. So I'm quickly going to take that out. And I quickly went ahead and took out the strap and also has so much protection. It came in this like long thing. I quickly had to unravel it from there. This bag has so much protection, like it's insane. But I mean, when you pay that much for a bag, I honestly hope it comes protected. It is so, so pretty. So this is what the strap looks like. And as you guys can see right here, it is an adjustable strap, which I love because I am taller. I'm like five, six-ish. So I need a strap that's going to be long. So if I can wear it crossbody and like over the shoulder, for me, that's a huge plus. That's honestly why I liked this bag because it was really nice, had structure to it and it was a really great size but it could also be worn over the shoulder and crossbody which like I said for me is a huge deal so I'm gonna go ahead and lower it to the last one just because like I said I am taller so I want it to kind of like fit my measurements and I'm also gonna go ahead and hook it on to the little gold clasps that are right here all right, so this is what the bag looks like now that it has the strap on. It looks absolutely beautiful. I love the detailing in this bag. And let me quickly go ahead and show you guys the inside because the inside is actually really nice. So right here we have a pocket. I have a Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus, so that fits perfectly in there and then also on the other side it comes with a zipper right here 
So as you guys can see, there's a zipper and there's also this little strap right here, which I feel like is perfect to kind of hold on to your keys, maybe even your wallet if it's kind of like a smaller wallet. But overall, I am absolutely obsessed with this bag. Let me quickly get into some details about the bag because I know when I'm watching unboxings and they don't give enough details, I it just drives me crazy. So like I said, this is the Michael Kors Selby Medium Cross Grain Leather Satchel. And this is in the color black, but it also comes in other colors. There's like this really pretty kind of like pinky color. There's gray, there's like a red, there's an ox blood it's called. It's kind of like a wine color. Absolutely beautiful. This is rated four stars on the Michael Kors website. And it says it is crafted from cross grain leather for a lightly textured effect. Its architectural shape is chic enough for the office and lends polish to off duty looks. Carry it by the hand handle or touch strap to wear as a crossbody. It says it's 100% cross grain leather. It has gold tone hardware. The handle drop is 4 inches. It has an adjustable strap 17 inches to 19.5. The interior details has a back zip pocket and a front slip pocket and it has the lining of 100% polyester. And it, of course, has a top zipper. It comes with a dust bag. And also, the measurements are 11 inches in width, 9.25 in height, and 5.25 in, like, how deep the bag is. And... I wasn't sure if I wanted to mention it or not, but I just figured I would because you guys can just look it up and like see it yourself. But this bag retails for $2.98. They do have sales sometimes, so you may be able to get a better deal on it. But for the most part, it does retail for $2.98. Like I said, this is a designer bag, so... Um, it was going to be a little bit pricier, but honestly, you can see it in the bag. You can just see it in like the layout of it, how beautiful it is. The material is absolutely gorgeous. It has little feet on the bottom, which are beautiful. So the feet pretty much touch the floor first and it really helps so that you don't get like scuffs on the bottom of the bag. I think it's absolutely beautiful like all around. I cannot believe this is mine. I am so happy and so thankful for it. I think the hard gold hardware adds such a beautiful touch to it. I personally love silver so for me to want something that has gold hardware it has to be like amazing and this purse honestly stands out so much. The detailing and it's just overall amazing. I am in love with it and this is 100% leather like I said but in the description it says it has a light texture to it and you can honestly see it and I think that makes the bag look even more beautiful. I'm going to quickly give you guys a close up of it. And overall, just from looking at it, I think it is such a spacious bag. I feel like I can fit a full-size wallet in here if I wanted to, my phone, my keys, even snacks for my kids. I probably won't be doing any, like, crazy snacks, maybe just gummies, or not gummies, like fruit snacks. I think that will be, like, my limit to this bag just because it is so beautiful and I don't want little snacks to mess up my purse. But, like I said, this is absolutely stunning. Like, I cannot believe this is mine. It is so beautiful. I definitely suggest if you guys have a Michael Kors nearby or anything, like, go in there and just look at their bags. And it'll definitely give you guys inspiration, motivation to really try and have one. I personally love designer, so for me, like, this is a huge thing. But I understand some people don't and don't really care for it. But for me, this is like a huge deal and I just think it is so beautiful and classy and you can really dress it up, dress it down. But personally, for me, this is kind of been going to be like a special purse to not wear like on a day to day basis. Like if I'm going taking the kids to the park, I'm not taking this, but more so 
um, like church, going out with my husband, things like that where I'm actually kind of doing something, not just, you know, going to the grocery store type of thing. But who knows? This might turn into my everyday bag. I'm saying that right now, but I mean, this might end up being like my everyday baby and I'm in love with it. Like I just cannot stop smiling. I think it looks so beautiful and I'm so happy I was able to do this unboxing for you guys and share it with you guys and I'm just so happy. Let me know if you guys have any bags that you guys love from Michael Kors or what was your kind of like first designer bag. I know this isn't like a huge designer like Louis Vuitton but to me this is you know like my starting piece and I am super happy with it and I think it is just so beautiful and I'm like very impressed with the quality that this purse has like it's absolutely beautiful definitely let me know what bags that you guys have and what your little baby is that you guys love and cherish also let me know if you guys would like to see a what's in my bag video maybe once I kind of start wearing it more often let me know if that's something that you guys would like to see and thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video bye